What's up everyone? Of course you are here to check out my video on the, the best duffel bag when it comes to martial arts training. I've had several different duffel bags and today I'm going to bring you guys a video on what I feel is the best overall duffel bag when it comes to training. I think if you're looking for kickboxing, you're looking for jiu-jitsu, you're looking for uh, MMA or maybe even submission wrestling, I think this is going to be the ideal duffel bag that's not going to break the bank and I think you're going to be really happy with it. Let's go ahead and get in the video. So let's break this bag down really quick. So as you see, of course, we have a zipper here. This pocket actually goes the full length of the bag. So when I travel to like jujitsu seminars and stuff, I will put my, um, my slides in here, my flip-flops for uh, going to the bathroom and everything. And you have another one of the same on this side. Again, this pocket goes all the way down the length. You have a flat bottom. And I'm gonna get into more about what this can do in a minute. So it can turn into a backpack if you uh, are excited. You do have the heavier D-rings here. I really like that. And there's one on both sides. The only complaint I, I have had so far with this bag is the D-rings get turned a lot. And I try to always turn them back to that. But I do like the fact that it's a heavy duty metal clasp. Of course you have the Velcro grips. But when we get into the bag itself, the zipper goes for all the way from here. So it kind of opens from the top. So like. If you were, if you had it just like as a backpack, you could reach in or you can go all the way. And of course you see it opens up nice and wide. And then you also have a mesh pocket right here. Like um, I will keep like stuff that I want to, to keep small, like, you know, your wallet or, or whatever in that pocket right there. And that's awesome. The fact that it's a nice big open pocket, I can put, um, like uh, two different keys in here, my rash guard, my fight shorts, if I was gonna use like spats or something, which I don't too, I don't very often, but this is great. I think this bag is perfect for everything. If it's gonna be like a jujitsu seminar, an MMA seminar, a kickboxing seminar, I think this is the ideal bag. I can fit my travel tie pads in here. I can fit my focus mitts in here. I can put my boxing gloves in here. I can put my MMA gloves in here, or my sparring gloves, I should say. I can fit all that stuff in here, and I'll, uh, I'll put a couple pictures showing this thing fully packed out, but this is, this is my go-to bag, and I've had a few other duffels, and they're discontinued now, so that's, that's kind of why I resorted to this one. I really like it, but here's also the thing I wanted to make sure I pointed out that I think makes this bag a little bit unique, and also one of the reasons why I recommend it, is you have this ability right here to unzip this, and you can pull your, your backpack handles out, and then you can connect them to this little section right here. And now you've just converted this duffel bag, but you can convert this bag into a backpack. So like right there, click. Now you can rocket it like a regular backpack. So if it's something you're looking forward to, like, man, I don't wanna have it over my shoulder, you can do that as well. So you, like I said, you can convert it into a backpack or a duffel. So that's one of the things that I really like about it. Of course, you get the little padded strap, which they don't do a whole lot. And RevGear's done a pretty good job. I mean, they branded it, of course. There's the RevGear title here, uh, this here. I do like the fact that it's this black and gray. It doesn't go with my gym colors, of course, but I also don't mind that. And then one of the nicer features, too, is once you have it all packed in, you can connect these here, and then you can cinch it down and take some of the sizing out of it. I have taken this pretty much all over and it has been my go-to bag. Like if I'm gonna go to uh, the jujitsu seminars and stuff and I've had at the three to four geese in here along with my fight shorts, my t-shirt, my clothing, my underwear, pants, shorts, whatever. And I've managed to still put this in the overhead bin in a, of an airplane. So if you're looking for a new duffel bag, I will put the link in the description box below and I'll even throw it up on the screen. But I would highly recommend checking out revgear.com to see if you can get your own duffel bag because this is this is a great bag it's not too expensive i think it's like 70 bucks compared to i know there's like a hayabusa one that's like 100 and something and even some of the others i do like this bag better than my punisher bag and better than my venom bag that i did a video on and again the reason is just because of the way the, the sizing is but i will say uh one of the things i liked about the venom and the punisher bag is they're, they have dividers, and I do like the fact that sometimes you can compartmentalize and have certain things in certain areas because it kind of helps with organization, whereas in this one, it's more just a major open pocket, 
So I guess if you had to have a complaint, that would be my one complaint is the fact that there are no, like this isn't a pocket, like I can't, I can't access just this section. But then at the same time, it's nice because it's big and open and you can kind of get all of your, all your gear in there. Like I said, I'll throw a, I'll throw a few pictures on there of what this bag looks like when it's fully decked out. So you can kind of see like, hey, you can fit a couple of geese, your belt, fight shorts, all that mess, and, and still be good to go. Zipper quality, the zippers are actually pretty good. They're not like the really tiny ones. They're pretty good size, they're big. They haven't, I haven't had any get kinked up or, or broken. And then you get the double zippers so you can have them in front of you so it's not all at the top. They seem to always get put up to the top for me, but that's kind of how it works. Well, there you guys had it. You have the uh, the duffel bag, as well as, like I said, it can turn into a backpack. So you can throw this bad mamma jamma right there on your back and be good to go. And so this is, for me, the ideal duffel bag when it comes to all kinds of training. You made it to the end of the video. You know what we're gonna ask. We're gonna ask you to do me a favor. You hit that like button. You go ahead and smash that subscribe button as it really helps us out with the YouTube algorithm. We have broken 10,000 subscribers and that is all possible thanks to you. Go ahead and hit that bell icon so you know the next video is coming out from all of us here at Martial Arts Limited. You guys stay safe, keep training. Go ahead and put in the comments what your favorite bag is and I will see if I can get a hold of one and check it out. Awesome, you guys stay safe, keep training. This is JD and I'm out.